guys welcome back to my channel if you're new here my name is jazzy today we are very excited <laughs> because i finally found my tripod so i had this like tripod that i was using for this camera that's like kind of one that i can carry around with me and guess where i found it <laughs> it was literally sitting on dominic's end table and like i put stuff on top of it which the whole time like the whole last month i've been thinking why did i put that stuff on top of that on dominic's end table like it's on his side of the bed why didn't i just leave him with his end table <laughs> for some reason i put this um like set to this night nighty set on his side of the bed i don't know if i was thinking about getting rid of it or something like it's one that i haven't worn in forever i actually got it from boohoo if you guys remember my boohoo haul <laughs> Like that was years ago now. I don't even know if it fits me anymore to be honest But it is sitting on his or it was sitting on his side of the bed And I just every time I walked by I was like, why did I put that there? I don't understand and then the other day I was like if we just like tidied up a little bit I think we would feel so much better about our house but then I was looking around and I was like, most of the shit <laughs> is mine. Like all of the stuff that's like miscellaneous sitting around everywhere. Because Dominic really doesn't own that much. I know I've talked to you guys about that in the past. But most of the stuff was mine. So I was like, okay, if I would just tidy up my stuff. Because I don't want him moving my things. But I ended up tidying up that side. And I ended up pulling my, like that set off. And literally right underneath it sits my tripod. Which was very frustrating because I've been looking everywhere for it. Like, like literally for the past month I have been looking everywhere for it so that I could vlog and like I haven't really been vlogging because I didn't know where it was not that I couldn't use a different tripod but I just like this one because I can like move around with it but anyway very exciting news I got a package from Lindy <laughs> so I'm gonna open this I actually got it for Valentine's Day it came like a few days after Valentine's Day so I'm pretty sure she sent it to be for Valentine's Day and your girl just has not opened it yet because you know you know <laughs> you guys know how I am but I'm really pumped about it she decorated it all cute like and like with the hearts and everything I was so happy when I opened the door to it but then I also was kind of like how did nobody steal this like if I saw this with all these cute little hearts I would be so curious what was in it if I was a postal worker also it was expensive for you to send this Lindy people be spending a lot of money on shipping and I just feel honored that you would be willing $18.40 I'm honored and you sent it on on Val or yeah on Valentine's Day that's so sweet <laughs> that's so sweet that you went on Valentine's Day for me I say and then I waited to open it but I promise you it's not because I didn't want to it's just because I love to have things to look forward to opening and to be honest you made the box way too cute it was just sitting there for like the longest time like me just looking at it it's literally just been sitting there because I love it so much but I think I'm gonna keep this box. Is that weird? <laughs> and like just use it as like a stand for something. Um, but anyway, let's open this up and see what we got from Lindy. Okay. You guys, it's so cute. Oh, it's already so adorable. Okay, so opening it up, it says Jazzy. There's a little card. Oh my gosh, it's so cute. Okay, I'll, I'll tell you guys what it says in a second. But let's open the card first. XOXO, this is so sweet. <laughs> Jazzy, I hope you enjoy this little box of goodies for for our lover era. Oh my God, so cute. I am forever grateful for the connection we share. You are such a bright light in this world. You make the whole place shimmer. This is, this is so adorable. <laughs> I'm so happy and proud of Miss Sunday and had to spoil her too. Don't worry, the cats are included too. Why are you so cute? Love you all to the moon and to Saturn. This is literally the cutest thing ever. I can't wait to hang this on my fridge. Adorable. Okay. It's literally so cute. This is your magic. So adorable. This is like perfect for Valentine's Day. I'm definitely going to hang this. How stinking cute is that? Oh my God. I love it. Thank you so much, Lindy. And then she's got all this cute, like, holy crap, you guys. There's actually a lot going on in here. <laughs> all this cute, uh tissue paper no you didn't oh my gosh i'm so excited okay so first things first oh my gosh this whole thing is so cute how you how did you what are you this is just a lot of cuteness going on right now you guys okay the first thing that there is is this cute little friendship bracelet how stinking adorable is that a friendship bracelet cookie Oh my gosh, that's literally so cute. It says, you make the whole place shimmer. BFF era. Oh my gosh. 
that is it's so cute <laughs> i love it so much oh my goodness adorable oh my gosh this is fun okay what i was actually jaw drop on the floor for was that she made me new ornaments one from the nights which she told me she was gonna do that and i was so excited she made me a midnight's one and then she also made me a um the tortured dead poets is that what it is no <laughs> tortured poets department that's what it is oh my gosh i'm so pumped about this this is so exciting oh my gosh i'm so excited thank you so much lindy you're so sweet <laughs> okay so moving on we got some cute little glasses lover eric glasses oh my god oh my gosh also they're kind of fun like everything's all pink that's adorable love these thank you lindy wow this is this is i'm stoked okay wait what is this this is a cute little rainbow compressed sponge what before so this is kind of giving tricky dink action you literally put this in water oh my god i can't wait to use this i can't wait to show you guys what this does because this is so cool you put it in water and then after it soaks it becomes a sponge what i've literally never heard of this before that is so cool i can't wait to do this oh my gosh it's so adorable so like such a creative thing also i just really want to know where you got this cookie from because like all of this is just so specialized and personalized you're so cute <laughs> okay let's see then we've got some little things for the kitties little um churro churro not churro, churro uh, like packets. They're for the baby kitties, that's so sweet. <laughs> I literally love you. Okay, so I'm overwhelmed. <laughs> I'm honestly overwhelmed by how many cute things are in here. Oh, this is cute. It says, I put a spell on you. That's adorable. So cute. I don't know what I'll put in this, but like definitely like so cute you can like literally put anything in this so i gotta figure out what i'm gonna put in this give me some ideas you guys because honestly this is adorable i'm definitely gonna have this on my desk for indefinitely to be honest <laughs> but so cute and it has like this cute little lid on it i mean i guess i don't really have to put anything in it but i kind of want to put something in it because i feel like it's it's so cute okay and then moving on we've got our friendship bracelets oh cute you made one with my name on it <laughs> so much fun <laughs> okay so let's see one of them says bejeweled so cute with all of the different colors of the eras bejeweled oh so cute give me a second you guys i actually <laughs> down its alarms going off give me one second okay we are back in, in action here um actually i can't wear these <laughs> i'm just gonna have them on because i just think they're adorable but um can't see anything because <laughs> they're like it's like literally makes let's see if i can actually show you guys if you put them on it literally there we go i can show you like it literally makes everything pink <laughs> so cute though i love them and then uh she made me one that says jazzy too with all the eras so stinking cute <laughs> lindy i just can't believe you'd literally do this for me <laughs> you always go all out you just treat me so special i'm so lucky i'm literally so lucky to have you okay so next this is the last thing but this is so cute <laughs> somebody's gonna die over this okay it's little champagne bottles oh hey chardonnay rosé all day and rise and wine so cute lindy <laughs> thank you so much like that was just so sweet and thoughtful all of this stuff i can't believe like i literally so when i talked to lindy about it i asked her if she'd make me another midnight and i told her i'd pay for it even and she's like no you don't have to pay for it and then she made me two like i literally only like i was only asking for this thing lindy you're just so sweet you always go above and beyond for everything so cute so like happy i'm so happy here packaging okay what do we want to do with this thing i want to hang this for sure Maybe like right over, right there. Maybe, can I hang it there, I wonder? Are we giving danger? Is that dangerous? To have that there? I don't think so. It's so cute. I love it so much, Lindy. You are so amazing. I love you. Okay, so that's all she wrote for that also i wanted to show you guys because my mom got me um the 
So she got me the Fearless Taylor Swift. Uh, I actually got a comment recently saying that like you love somebody, one of you <laughs> loves my Taylor Swift content and that just made me so happy because I've been missing doing Taylor Swift content but like I, I didn't know if it was like overwhelming to people and I'm sure it is overwhelming to some people but I know that a lot of us are Swifties and I just love her so much and so like it was just nice to hear that like somebody loved my Taylor Swift content because I have been missing doing Taylor Swift content and you know catch me here on April 20th or no it'll actually be April 19th because she releases it at midnight so catch me here April 19th doing a review of the Tortured Poets department because you guys I am literally going to die over that I, I literally know that that is going to be my favorite album like probably I don't know I, I don't know for sure but like I just I have a feeling in my soul like the aesthetic of it is so me so my vibes <laughs> like I just love like romantic and like sensual and like the words I, I love words you know I'm, I'm a big poetry person so like I'm just so excited <laughs> to for that to come out and like the the pictures themselves like that's like totally up my alley like the covers of her albums are so they're just so me I'm not gonna lie um when it comes to like my photography and stuff they're definitely bringing back uh it's definitely bringing back like a younger version of myself but I am so here for it and I you guys know I love to reminisce so I'm excited I'm so excited there's my lipstick I was just, literally just looking for this lipstick before I started filming and I couldn't find it so I had to put a different one on but whatever it is what it is okay what I was actually wanting to show you guys was that my mom she got me the um vault apparently i was like shocked mind blown <laughs> when she showed me this she got me the vault um snow globe i'm gonna go grab it and show you guys because now i have like this little display out there i actually can't wait to show you guys the whole apartment because it's it's looking good you guys it looks so nice and like it's so much better than it used to be we actually have a whole gym set up over here i guess i could show you right now but i'm not going to because i don't want to move you around yet but i have we have like a gym set up going on here and then my computer is like over here in my office and then um we moved the bed into the living room it's us it's crazy but it works so well for us like it's perfect for us I, I'm so happy we ended up like committing to changing everything because not only is it good for us but like for Sunday it's made her sleeping so much better <laughs> it's made her sleeping so much better hi sweet girl my sweet baby I'll have to give her one of those toys um when she's like not She's sleeping right now, so I'm really pumped about that. We're gonna leave her sleeping for now, but we'll give her one of the toys later. Um, but anyway, let me grab that thing so I can show you. Okay, so what happened is this. <laughs> My mom ordered me this, which is the Vault Snow Globe for Taylor Swift for Fearless. Like, I was jaw on the floor when I realized that she somehow got this. Like, when did she order this? It would have had to been forever ago when Fearless was released, right? Like, I haven't seen it on the site literally since it was released but it came broken so the way that it came like you can't not tell like it's it's literally perfect in my opinion <laughs> but it is it does have a little chip on the top which to me no big deal like when my mom was explaining it to me she's like it's wrecked because it kind of looked wrecked when I we first like when she showed it to me but I fixed it so it doesn't look wrecked anymore and she was like you're it's it sucks like I don't even think you're gonna want it and pff, I mean it's great so anyway you open it and cute <laughs> it's so cute i love it so much so it's got all the vault songs in there um the only negative is that like you can't turn the music off which i think is normal but the button for turning the music off isn't there so that's another thing and then this ball like kind of falls out a little bit like nothing is nothing is right <laughs> but it isn't wrong enough <laughs> for me because I just am so obsessed with it I think it's so cute and like obviously you're not gonna open it anyway it's gonna just sit there let's see let me see if I can get a reflection to not is that better that's a little better but it's just gonna sit there like it's not gonna you're not gonna open it very often so and even when you do open it you can't really tell that there's anything wrong with it like the ball literally if if it tips upside down the ball like literally falls out but ain't no big deal for me regardless let me actually change my battery really quick so i can keep talking to you guys okay battery has changed but basically what happened was she received it and she said this is not right like she said this is not good because it was falling out and everything so she emailed the um taylor swift obviously taylor nation and if you guys are taylor swift fans you know like okay i'm not gonna be that, that type of person that only defends taylor at all costs because i think this is actually bullcrap the way that her store is run like it's absolutely insane that she doesn't have any like that she doesn't 
invest more in a better store situation because my mom reaches out to them right and they reach out back to her literally like months I'm talking like probably three or four months later and they say hey like do you um we can't we can't send you a new one of these because we don't have any anymore but we can send you a lover house now my mom asked me and you guys all know that I traded my lover house for the new lover house like I traded or I traded my all too well snow globe for the lover house but if they had reached back out to my mom in time like I we would have been able to have this conversation and my mom would have, like I wouldn't have ever had to trade my all too well snow globe and so I am really frustrated by that because I would still have my all too well snow globe and I'd have a lover snow globe and I'd have this snow globe it would be wild but anyway my mom I'm like can you ask them if they will send another one which was a huge mistake on my part because they don't do that like they do not they're horrible so I'm like can you ask them if they have any of the other options like the speak now snow globe or something and so my mom asked them do you have any of the other options and they not only don't respond to her but they when they do end up responding to her months later well not months but a month later they end up responding to her and they say we're just gonna refund you your money that you paid for the snow globe have a nice day basically and so like they refunded her what the $50 like I don't remember how much these were maybe 70 but they refunded her the amount that these cost regularly to the site but like now we could have had another snow globe and had I known like had I even thought about it which I should have I should have just said yes let's take the lover snow globe because those are worth like 150 at least well maybe 100 now because it's the newer lover snow globe but regardless I would have just kept both snow globes if I'm being honest because they mean a lot to me <laughs> but it's just frustrating because the way that that site works the way that Taylor Nation works that site is so messed up like even um she placed an order on black friday and they well actually she did get that order though so never mind it's really not that bad but you guys know those of you that placed an order for black friday like they didn't get your orders to you in time for christmas my um actually do i have a video of that i might insert a video of that this might be very taylor forward video because i'm pretty sure i took a video when i opened my um my did i maybe i never did take a video of when i opened the um 1989 card again or if I did maybe I posted already if not I will insert it at the end of this clip but that my 1989 card again literally did not come forever like it took them forever to send me my 1989 card again I'm talking six or seven months to get my 1989 card again and I placed the order day of and same with like the 1989 albums I placed the order day of like the the first I was one of the first people to place that order for all four albums and a um and the whatever that thing is called the record and why do I have, we have fruit flies now because we're we've been loving apples lately <laughs> and the fruit flies be coming with the apples but anyway it was just frustrating because I didn't receive the 1989 stuff for months later either and everybody else had received their 1989 stuff that they had ordered after I had ordered he had this one fruit fly he doesn't want to die but he wants to stick around <laughs> um but anyway it is what it is the, regardless I'm very excited about this and I am pumped for this <laughs> but I actually am so curious like there you guys don't even understand like sometimes I'd be recording clips yeah here we go Taylor Swift unboxing did I poke? I, okay, so yeah, I literally recorded, it was like a whole intro. You guys, this is going to be a weird video, but I recorded a whole intro with that um, 1989 cardigan and I never finished the video. This happens to me a lot, <laughs> but it was like maybe a month ago now. It wasn't too long ago. Like I still think it's relevant, so I'll insert the clip after this, but um, yeah, just a bummer. A bummer overall. <laughs> Anyway, you guys, I am going to insert that clip now. I'm sorry, this is kind of a weird video at this point, but I just know that I knew I took a clip of it. And let's see, let me see how that starts even. Okay, I am gonna, I actually am gonna insert that. I'll insert it now and then I'll come back to you guys. But I just watched a little clip of it and it's funny. So it's put, it, there's a point to put it in. It's just like there's so, it's so often that I like record an intro and then never finish the video and then you guys just never see it. Like I can't even tell you how many times I've done that. It's horrible. <laughs> I'm like really bad when it comes to that kind of stuff because then I don't, I forget to finish it. Like I start every video with, hey guys, welcome back to my channel if you're new here my name is Jazzy and like almost every time I film like that's what that's my go-to and I forget that I already filmed an intro it's it gets hard when you're only posting one video a week you guys I know that you guys would like me to post more as well because I definitely would <laughs> but look how cute this is too with the little heart on the Y so adorable anyway you guys I want to insert that now so you guys can see the 1989 cardigan this is also the speak now cardigan that we love 1989 cardigan you'll see you'll see my review on that <laughs> 
Good morning, you guys. Welcome back to my channel. If you're new here, my name is Jazzy. Today is so hot. <laughs> it's honestly ridiculous. Also, my apologies for whatever you see behind me <laughs> because it's honestly a mess in here as well. But it's so hot and I just don't understand. I know, baby, you want a drink? She just, you know, she thinks that I'm talking to her <laughs> when I'm talking to you guys and she likes to respond. So we're gonna use her beverage really quick. All right, I don't actually think she's thirsty. She just wants attention. <laughs> but anyway, you guys, I am so pumped <laughs> because finally, finally, <laughs> I received my 1989 cardigan. <laughs> so I actually ordered two because I thought these were gonna be so needed by everyone that I wanted to have one to sell and nobody wants them. <laughs> nobody wants them, not only that, but I didn't receive it till now. Like I didn't receive it till literally February, March. Like how crazy is that? <laughs> It's actually insane, honestly, that it took that long because I ordered it in October, you guys, the 1989 cardigan. I am also like just dying of heat right now. <laughs> but we're gonna open this together because I can't wait to see what it looks like in person because everybody says that they don't like them. <laughs> so I can't wait to see what I think because also everybody said they didn't like the um, Speak Now one and your girl was obsessed. <laughs> like I actually still wear my Speak Now one all the time. It's probably my favorite cardigan. Like it's so comfortable. <laughs> so I don't know what everyone else is thinking, but I personally love the Speak Now one, but we're gonna see. I also got one other thing, uh, like a sweater. And if this doesn't tell you guys, like those of you that aren't Taylor Swift fans, how long ago this was, this was when Dominic and I went to New York City. I ordered this like the week before we went to New York City. So it's been months now. <laughs> like it's been so long since I um, placed this order. And I mean, isn't that just so, so UMG of this order <laughs> to come in so late? Oh man, you guys. But anyway, wait, you guys. I love it, I love it. It's actually so pretty in person. Oh my gosh, the color is actually stunning in person. Oh, I'm so stoked. <laughs> I'm so excited right now. Oh my gosh, I can't wait to try this on. I'm gonna try this on with you guys after we open everything. Um, But this looks so beautiful. Let's just open this up because I am so excited right now. <laughs> okay. So so let's see. I was so pumped when they released the design. Like I know it wasn't what everyone wanted it to be. Oh wow. It's short. <laughs> it's so short. Oh my gosh, it looks like a crop. It's like a crop situation. Maybe once I stretch it out a bit, let's see. Let's just see if it's stretchable. Yeah, okay, definitely. <laughs> I'll definitely be able to stretch it out a bit, but at the moment, she's giving. She's giving little schoolgirl. She's giving Mandy Moore in Walk to Remember. <laughs> like, it's really short, but I like it. The material's nice. It's definitely more the material I feel that the original cardigans are made out of. So I have an original cardigan, and then I also have a Speak Now cardigan, and I personally like them both. Like, I think they're both great material, to be honest. I know everybody hates the Speak Now, and I know that, like, I'm going to be foot my mouth for that because people really don't like the Speak Now cardigan. But I love the material of it. I think it's so comfortable. This is like definitely more of the other material from like the original folklore cardigans. But I really like it. The only thing I don't love, obviously, is the eagles on the back or eagles. That's what they are, right? No, seagulls. <laughs> yeah, it's eagles. But I don't really love that necessarily. But I do think that like it's fine. It is what it is. And I, I'm not going to hate on it because I honestly love it. Okay, so we'll try that on and see what we think of it um and then the other thing that i got was obviously the sucking cardigan like i said and then i also ordered i think this is why it took so long because people were getting the cardigan like literally seconds after they ordered it which was insane <laughs> and like i unfortunately placed the order with this that w gave me like i had till december i think 29th or something to for them to send it out and they didn't obviously it's literally been like three more months or two more months since then but let's see how this one looks. I haven't actually seen this one anywhere online either. So um, I'm stoked about it though, because I love it. Okay, so the material, it's actually not a bad material. It's interesting. Okay, let me face it towards me, you guys, sorry. But 
Yeah, I love it. I love it. I think it's so cute. <laughs> okay, I actually can't wait to wear this. The material inside is like super soft. So I mean, would I have loved to receive this in December when it was freezing? Absolutely. But I didn't. <laughs> so we're just gonna be happy with what we got here. But I do think that like it's super cute, you guys. I actually love it. So let's try these on. Okay. So first things first. I only have half on, obviously already. But I realize I should be filming while I'm putting it on. So. <laughs> this is a 3XL, uh, 3 to 4XL, and it's giving not that to me. Like, honestly, it's fitting more just not the way that the other ones fit. I mean, not even the way that the Speak Now one fits. It's actually such a disappointment. Oh my gosh. I actually can't believe how disappointed. <laughs> it's still really cute, okay? <laughs> it's still, like, actually so cute, and I still love the color of it, but I just wish that it was a little bit bigger through here. Um, but I, I think it'll stretch a bit, so, like, once I wear it a few times, it'll stretch a bit, but it's definitely just giving Walk to Remember vibes. <laughs> you know, like, how she would wear those little like like a young christian girl <laughs> that's what it's really honestly but i guess that's what it's going for now that i think of it not that 1989 was like young christian girl <laughs> but it's definitely more of like the preppy look which maybe is what it's going for but i don't know you guys it's not my favorite it's still comfortable definitely gonna sell the other one because like i was kind of also like maybe i want to keep both of them <laughs> because i really love my speak or yeah my speak now one so i wish i had a second one just like to have in case the other one like has any issues in the future but this i definitely think i really only need one of these <laughs> it is still cute though but like i said it's just shorter than i personally would like um and this is what it looks like so that's the that's the cardigan <laughs> okay next up we have this which has little this has little to no stress stress this has little to no stretch you guys so i mean okay that's not, that's a lot it has stretch but it's just not it's not the stretch i was imagining it to have i honestly pictured it being a little bit more stretchy but Oh, it's cute. <laughs> it's actually so cute. Oh my god, I love this. Okay, so it fits me super, super comfortable, like, in the arms and everything. Oh, I love this one. I love this one so much. Okay, so this is definitely better than the cardigan. This was worth the wait. The cardigan? I don't know. <laughs> I don't know, I don't know. I was honestly considering, like, emailing them and asking for a refund of the whole order because I was just like, I spent a lot of money on this for it to not have been received yet, but... I really like this one. I'm really happy I didn't do that now because I think this is so cute. Oh, love it. Love it, love it, love it. <laughs> okay, you guys, back to me now. <laughs> I wanted to tell you guys, I know I showed you guys this Timu um, mug in another video and 10 out of 10 recommend. I feel like it's just as good as the 1989 one. I don't know if it's as good as Stanley because I don't have the Stanley, but definitely recommend there was something else that i got too that i wanted to show you guys let's this is just gonna be this is a crazy video i i guess i picked up the camera not knowing what i was gonna film but here we are and i feel like i should give you updates on everything from that timu video so this is 10 out of 10 recommend i will insert a clip of the stand that i got for dominic dominic loved everything i got for him he loved the knives he loved the stand um for the controllers he was so excited and the only thing he didn't necessarily like was the card that said old bay <laughs> i should have evaluated that better i didn't really think about the fact that i'm calling him old bay <laughs> but i didn't i thought he'd think that was funnier he, it's not that he didn't like it but he didn't laugh the way that i expected him to but he did ask me where i got the card which makes me think that he did believe or he did believe it he did he also probably believed it but <laughs> he did like the card also our birthdays you guys you guys i have not talked to you in a hot minute we were planning on going on a trip for our birthdays and we ended up not <laughs> So we ended up not going on a trip because there was some hubbub going on with Dominic's job and they, we just, things were up in the air. Let's put it that way. You guys will know more soon and we will know more soon, hopefully, but there was a lot going on. So we just decided to scratch trip because we might've needed the money for something else. <laughs> if we had, we came into a position where we were going to be moving possibly, um, which would have been crazy, but I don't think that's happening now, which is kind of like a good thing and a bad thing at the same time because we were both kind of getting pumped over it. But um, but I don't know. We we really aren't sure. So we scrapped having a trip yet. Um, so that's that's just the tea on that that we didn't end up going on a trip. And um, that was fine though because Dominic ended up still taking off and we ended up like spending time 
here <laughs> actually you guys literally we're in it right now it's like one of the last days till he has to go back to work but we ended up just hanging out here and like enjoying ourselves kind of like going out to eat and just like chilling we've never done that before like usually for vacations like when dominic takes time off of work we literally want to go places and i say we but it's always me like dominic wants to be off of work here like <laughs> he likes to be home and i forget that like i'm home more often than him so, like way more often than him so like for me i want to go somewhere when he's off of work but for him he doesn't get to relax at home ever so it was really nice honestly and we had a really really good time and it was still really special like we still you know had a great time it was our anniversary for um our engagement so if for those of you that are new here we got engaged on um february 29th of 2020 which is a very weird time to get engaged <laughs> but that was the day we got engaged dominic proposed to me right between both of our birthdays his birthday is the 25th and my birthday is the third and that was like right in the middle and it was just like perfect and we said we were gonna do trips every four years but like to be fair we go on trips anyway <laughs> so like we really didn't need to commit to that and like that was our plan was just to go on a trip because it's been four years and like we only get to celebrate that anniversary every four years but we still had so much fun so i'm not complaining it was kind of gloomy weather out though but other than that we had a really good time also it's really fun that both of our birthdays kind of land like near each other because for all of the apps you know how you get like coupons and stuff <laughs> for your birthday we were both like getting coupons at the same time so we were able to get like free stuff the whole time and it's been a good time what else did i want to update you guys on oh the knife set he loved the knife set too i'll put a did i already say this about the knife set i'll put a video of the knife set over top too if i already said it oh well but the knife set looks really really good on the um magnetic thing that my mom ended up getting him that i told you guys about and then what else did i get anything else i think everything else was just like earrings yeah, that's literally everything. Oh, other than the other thing I want to update you guys on is the safety keychain and the safety keychain. Amazing. I have loved having that on my keychain. I feel infinitely safer, even though like I probably it doesn't really make that much of a difference. But I just feel like I'm taking that extra precaution. And like when I would go for walks at night or like just go for walks ever, it's so nice to have that alarm on me. Like I always feel like I'm safe or even when I like you guys know like as a woman like it's almost it's even scary like walking in and out of stores so it's just nice to have that like extra safe thing and then the other thing i wanted to update you guys on is the nails which i never used yet so can't really update you guys on those yet um i tried to use them and they don't they didn't come with a nail glue so i have to order a nail glue the other thing one more thing <laughs> is the eyebrow clipper that i ordered and i still don't know how to use that i tried and i have no idea how to use it but anyway, you guys, um, she's still sleeping. What do we do here? I want to give her one of those things. <laughs> As the day goes on, we'll see it when she wakes up. I'll give her one of those toys and we'll see how she likes them. I know she's going to love them. But anyway, you guys, I am going to wrap this video up here. If she ends up playing with the toy, I will overlay the video at the end of the vlog. But I love you and I've missed you guys. And I hope you guys liked this video. I know it was literally just me sitting here talking to you, but i miss doing that i love doing that with you guys so thank you for being here and i'll see you guys in the next one what is this is this for my pupper is this for my pupper did your auntie lindy get you this is this for my baby you ready you ready <laughs> you ready baby <laughs>